Hi there, Jamie Keat here today at Teachers Tech. Hope everyone's having a great day today. Today I want to take a look at how to add another channel to your existing YouTube channel. And once you do that, how you can add managers to help you manage your channels and how to delete this at the end if you don't want it. So stick around and let's learn how to do this. So I recently created a YouTube channel on my school one because I didn't want to give people access to my school email account. So what I did was create another YouTube account on that and then I could add managers so I can get help managing our YouTube page uh, just by adding managers to it. So let's go ahead and get started here. And the first thing you need to do is go up to the top here and then you just need to go uh, to this cog right here where it says YouTube settings. Click on that. And then you can see where it will say uh, right here, uh, see all my channels and create a new channel. So just go ahead and click on that. And then you're gonna be brought to this page where if you had other channels, it would show it in here. Um, I've created examples once before and deleted what I'll show you to do today too. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and create a new channel here. And I'm just gonna go ahead and type the name in here. So I'm just gonna call this, I'll call this example. I could do it with a space in between. I don't have to put a space. So when you name it on here, uh, you have the one space, you can name it how you want to have it. So I'll just call it example channel like this. Uh, you can select a category. You can see what categories you have. I'm just gonna select other here. And I'm gonna agree to the terms here because you get a Google uh, Plus page with your channel. So I'm just gonna hit done here. And very quickly, it creates a new channel here, just like this. So you can see I would still have to add uh, the art and everything to this uh, and set up my playlist and everything out and however I'd want it. But if I go up here, you can see it just used the first letter, the example, the E in example uh, to put up there so you can change your icon there. So uh, I have this added to my channel here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and hit the YouTube settings on this one right here. And then what you can do at this point, if you notice, you can add or remove managers. So I'm just gonna click on add or remove managers here. Uh, and you can see uh, different ones. So I have the one, the general uh, account and info here, the users manage permissions. This is what I'm gonna click on right now. And I'm just gonna add, actually I'm gonna add one of my uh, other email addresses on it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add people here and click on this. And I'm just gonna put, uh, actually I'm gonna put, I'll just put this one, info at, at uh, teachers, this one right here. All right, so uh, then I'm just gonna put, uh, yep, I'm gonna invite this one, Oop, choose a title, gotta choose a title first. I'm gonna say manager. And you can see I have different choices here from owner uh, to communications manager, but I'm just gonna put manager here. Then I can send the invite like so. So now I have a different one on here. So I'm gonna hit done. And then I'm gonna go over uh, to show you uh, on my other email address of how that looks. So at this point, I just switched over to my other account that I sent to manage this one and I got this one to accept of invitation. So you just go through and accept the invitation and then you're gonna get another email after you do that uh, that says you are now a manager. So if I go into get started now, and move over to here. I'm just gonna click on uh, the YouTube uh, symbol right here to manage this channel here. And you'll be able to see, so I don't use the, these channels for anything, but I can go from the channel that's part of this one that I have, or this is the one that I gave permissions to. So if I click on this one, you can see this is the example channel up here that I can go through and manage the settings and different things, even though I wasn't the owner or created it from that account, but now I have that one there. So you can see I can add or remove managers from this point, uh, but it gives me that ability uh, to go through and add videos and different things like that. So it should save you some time. So I'm just gonna go uh, back to my other account now, and I'm just gonna delete it from my original account that I, uh, that I had started with here. So if you want to delete this channel, just uh, simply go up and switch to the channel that you want to delete. So I wanted to delete this example channel here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click on that. And now I've switched over to, uh, to that one. And now I'm gonna go to the cog, the YouTube settings here and click on it. And then make sure you go to advanced. You can see the link that's right there click on it and then where you can go from there at the bottom is delete channel. So when you click delete, you have to, you can have a choice here. You could hide your content, but I wanna delete this channel. Just a couple of checks right here and hit delete my content. You have to type in the exact same thing that they have 
uh, here that uh, what you named your uh, account and then you hit delete my content and it says content was successfully uh, deleted. So uh, I'm just going to quickly go back to my uh, YouTube uh, dashboard here and uh, what you can see. So now if I uh, drop down from the top here, you notice the account is gone there. So uh, that's how you do it. That's how you add a new account, uh, add managers. Uh, it's a very simple process and can come in very handy uh, if you're wanting to give that permission to other people. So I hope you liked this uh, tutorial today. If you have, please give it a thumbs up, share with a few people. And remember, I do these weekly tech tips, so please subscribe to my channel. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.